Aw, thank you. Thank you so much. That's, That's beautiful. I'm Terry. Awesome. Terry, I'm Frugal RV gal. I know. Okay. I know. <laughs> <laughs>I just got here. He's eyed a big kahuna. <laughs> I can't say it without giggling. <laughs> Said he has something for us. We're only a little afraid. Yeah. <laughs> Sun's all in the wrong spot. Aw. Oh. <laughs> I eyed a big kahuna. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so. I have one video up. Well, cool. Just to search, so YouTube will, you yeah. know, if, you, if you search on it. But uh, this is my first RV meetup. Yay! Well, glad you're here. Thank you, Lola, for doing what you did. Well, you did great. Thank you. And <laughs> thank you for the updates. And we're know. just real glad you're here. Yeah, I, I can't wait. Now the fun begins. Now we can start the party. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what do you want to ask me? So hey, will you show us your van? No. Please? <laughs> oh, that's nice. <laughs> okay. It's under construction. Okay. So about halfway done and I've got the floor, the subfloor in, all the insulation in for the floor, most of the ceiling and the walls. Um, I got my platform bed going across in the back. Um, I've got my fridge freezer, 62-quart winter compressor. Cool. So that's going to work out great. I, I, I loaded it full for you ladies. Oh, yeah? I did. I did. It's full so of what? Full of good food. Awesome. And nothing to help. <laughs> Yay. My, part, my favorite So kind. for lunch, if uh -huh. you want to stop by, I'll make you a sandwich. I'll make you a Sammy. How's that? All right. Okay. So I got 300 watts of solar on the roof. Okay. Um, there's a TV antenna mount mm -hmm. with an articulating antenna that is not installed right now. Uh-huh. Um, so it'll swivel up and then it'll rotate towards the towers. Nice. And then I have composite decking, which is actually in the van. Um, I'm building a small deck with the remaining area in the back. So I'll be able to uh, get up there and go to NASCAR or the beach or the desert or whatever awesome. and just sit there and swivel. Great. So yeah, um, and then I guess a couple of security lights here yeah. that are motion sensitive and uh, trigger. Windows are tinted. Um, Can we take a little peek inside? Yeah, it's a mess. All right, that's okay. It's a work in progress. There's his roommate. Yeah, she's in jail. She just snapped her cord. <laughs> so yeah, um, if you want to step up and take a look, I don't know what kind of lighting you're going to get. Got the insulation going on. Yeah, and all that's coming down. I love the little ladder storage yeah, there. Yeah, because I didn't want to put a um, permanent ladder on the outside. Uh -huh. that, that invites people to get on your roof. That's true. Um, so yeah, this was, I don't know, Amazon. Yeah. Most everything is Amazon, Home Depot, Walmart. Uh-huh. And cool. Uh, and that's your fridge? That's big. Yeah, it's 62. It, the freezer's on. Either one can be a fridge, fridge or a freezer. freezer. Yeah. How neat. Um, it's going to be in here. Okay. And it'll be on uh, slide rails. So cool. It'll come out. My uh, shower is going to be in the back. Oh, you're going to have a shower? Yeah, with my composting toilet in it. And... Then in f coming north, I'm going to have storage, and then I'm going to have like a three or four foot couch. Really? Right here. Over the, fr oh, because no, the fridge will be in, will here. Be in yeah. here. Yeah. This is an yep. Ikea chopping block. It's not mounted. <laughs> and, and this is your water? No, that's oh. just conduit for uh, 110. Oh, okay. Uh, and then there's a three stage reverse osmosis water purification system underneath here. Cool. And try to climb up in yeah, here. Get all in your business. Yeah, you can get in my business. Your business. Oh, that's cool. Nice bed back there. Yeah, and so it's like I said, it's a mess. It's under I love it. So I have my Max Air fan put in. 
You just work on it whenever you're bored. And no, I work on it virtually every day. Cool. Unless I'm too hungover. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna use um, five millimeter plywood and cover it in indoor outdoor carpeting. Yeah. Um, and I'll show you an example of what I got back here if you want to look. This was kind of like the test piece. So, I'm going to do this. Oh yeah, that'll look very nice. So, i got to find my clips that I pulled out uh -huh. and put them back in. So this is just sitting. Yeah. That's the only thing holding it. That'll be very nice. Yeah. <laughs> music, yeah. I see what your priorities are. Yeah. You're a fantastic fan. Yep. Your bed. Yep. Man, that's a high bed. Yeah. I, I needed space. I yeah. Need. To and put up there, yeah. So I've got all my tools. It took me a whole day to consolidate uh -huh. all my hand tools. Just to get them all in just there. Just to get them in here. This thing weighs a ton. Yeah. And I've got two... 22 gallon water tanks uh -huh. you can see those okay and those are going to be connected so that they drain equally uh-huh um neat and i have a hot water heater propane instant hot water heater right here that i have to mount so you're going to put a shower in here with the drain and everything yeah um that's so and then cool. i got four jerry cans right here two diesel one water one gasoline 2000 watt uh, generator and my little Weber grill right here which we're going to break out. Awesome. And then you just lock all that up and Yeah, it's all locked up, secured, waterproof. Very good. Uh, my first rack got stolen right in front of my house. Oh no. Um, I didn't have a locking hitch pin. Uh huh. So I fixed that. Real quick, yeah. Bought another one. The wheels were just stock cargo wheels. Uh huh. Um, and I took a deck of playing cards and fanned them out between the rim and the tire and took black matte uh, Rust-Oleum paint uh -huh. and spray painted the wheels. I love it. Yeah. Okay, so from here to here is five feet. Okay. And underneath, I've got 12 inches of clear space. Mm -hmm. So I went to the plumbing supply place Got an eight inch PVC pipe with two end caps, mm -hmm. and that's my gray water tank. And it's gonna go right up underneath right there, and the shower is gonna be like right here. Cool. And it'll just drain down right into the tank right here. And then here's where the sofa's gonna be, or the couch. Uh huh. And then underneath the couch, I have a 12 point something gallon propane tank that I'm going to mount underneath uh -huh. the couch that can be filled with the hose through the side door and it'll have a trap door that comes down. Yeah. So uh, Very well thought out. Is any of this drawn on paper or is it just all yeah, in your I mind? Yeah, I have all the drawings. <laughs> uh, I, I have all the drawings. Uh, I have a big four inch uh, binder. Uh, of all the drawings, and then I got a big box of receipts, uh -huh. and so and all my labor hours. Oh, nice! Um, so I know how much to sell it for if I ever sell it. My next door neighbor actually has offered me a hundred thousand when I'm done. Yeah. And I'm like, what are you What are you gonna do with it, man? He goes, I'm gonna lease it out. Just lease it out. That's yeah. So on one hand, that's brilliant, but on the other hand, man, one renter can really yeah. do a lot of damage. Yeah, so, um, yeah, so I have uh, swivel seats. These things uh, turn. Oh, nice. Um, so they cool. swivel around. Um, tons of storage up here on the top. Yeah. I got my GoPro, my dash cam. Nice. Oh, what good. Year is it? Smart. It's 2014. How many miles from now? 75. It was a lease return from a from a uh, local DFW area um, 
water restoration company. They suck the water out when you have a flood. Yeah. And um, they recycle them. They have a fleet of 40 vans and um, they're sprinters and freight liners. So they just recycle them back into Mercedes Benz Plano mm -hmm. and sold it to you. I saw it on the website, went there the next day. They had six of them for sale. Uh -huh. By the time I got there the next day, there was two left. Wow. This one and a, 20, and a 2015. Uh -huh. and, yeah, uh, probably both. Yeah. So, yeah, I got a pretty good deal on it. Yeah. Um, care to share? Care to share? I, 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 don't, I don't mind telling you. Um, I paid 20000 Yeah. Wow. Um, I've seen them. That's a heck of a deal. Yeah. 75,000 miles, 20,000, uh -huh. 2014. Now get this, th here's the thing. I'm driving down the road like last month, Yeah. and my death light comes on, if you're familiar with diesel emissions. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And that means you gotta add fluid, right? Yeah. So I chunk fluid in it. Or else they it. start chugging down. Uh -huh. Yeah, and yeah, you get the uh, countdown mode. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I got to one restart. And I'm like, I gotta take it into the shop. Yeah. So I drove it in, and I'm on zero gas or diesel. Uh -huh. There's no fuel in the tank. Oh the no. The light's been on for 40 miles. Mm. You carry the high def with you, or I carry the high def. Yeah, with no, you. I have it. Mm -hmm. And um, the guy says, "Okay, clear the road, get this guy through," and it was in the shop for 10 days. Oh man. So they gave me an ES300 mm. as a loaner, and I'm like, man, I. Screw the van. <laughs> so, um, he come well a couple days into it. He calls me back. He goes, "You got two clogged NOx sensors, uh, nitrogen oxide." Uh huh. And uh, I said, "How much?" And he goes, "Man, it's under warranty." Nice. And I was going, "Okay." So when I picked it up, they had a half a tank of fuel in it, and didn't cost me a thing. I said, "How much would it have cost?" He goes, "Twenty five hundred." Wow. And you have 800 miles until your warranty expires. <laughs> it was eight years, 80,000 miles. Uh -huh. And I, I was like 800 miles away from it. That's great. So I, I was like, God. This is your lucky van, yeah, I think. Yeah, so. Well, thank you for showing it no to problem. me. No problem. I'm going to step over there and see if I can get a shot of those solar panels. Yeah, go Yeah, for it. pretty cool, pretty cool. Good, good at editing, I know. It's got a four-cylinder diesel. It's 20 miles per gallon. It's it, a four-cylinder? Four-cylinder turbo diesel, seven-speed, automatic. 20 miles per gallon in the city, consistently. How's it going? Wow. It's plenty of power. Huh. Plenty of power. No problem. I need to know when you get to Arizona if that holds what, true. RTR? Yeah. Getting over some of those passes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Texas is kind of flat. We'll read it. Yeah. Stay lost, my friends. We are approaching the infamous I'd be a big campsite. <laughs>